Hey teachers, back with another tech tip. Google Slides presentations, just like Google Docs, all have URLs attached to them. So you could copy and paste the URL and share it with anyone. However, the problem is that that URL is going to share that slide deck in edit mode. And that may be fine if it's a colleague you know, who will be collaborating on the slides with you or something like that. But sometimes when you want to share your slides, you don't want the viewer to be able to edit those slides. You may not know that there are a couple of quick edits that you can do to the URL so that you can share your slide deck in different views. The first option is to add the word copy to the end of the URL. You simply highlight everything from the word edit all the way to the end and then replace it with the word copy. When you paste that in a new tab, it will automatically force a copy that can be saved to your own Google Drive. Other times it's not necessary for the person you're sharing with to be able to edit the document at all. You simply wanna share the slide deck in present mode. Just highlight the end of the URL, just like we did before, and this time replace it with the word present. When you paste it in a new tab, it will open the slide deck in present mode. If you like present mode, but you don't like that little toolbar that comes with it, there's one last way that you can share the slide deck to make that toolbar disappear. So one last time you delete everything at the end of the URL, but this time you replace it with a phrase, preview question mark, R M equals minimal. When you paste this in a new tab, it will open your slide deck in present mode, but without the toolbar. So to recap, the endings for the URL when you're sharing a slide deck, could be the word copy, the word present, or the phrase preview question mark RM equals minimal. For more time savers and tech tips, subscribe to my YouTube channel.